Hi. So we are not looking for uh, promotion all the time. If we are stagnant mid senior in development sector, and this may surprise you because everybody is looking for promotion and hike and increment and getting to the next level, all that. I'll be honest, you know, in development sector, promotions and increments are not easy to come by because there are very, very few opportunities for rapid growth as it happens in corporates, in marketing or sales or production sector. In development sector, it cannot be so because if you connect your performance with the outcome, then the outcome is very slow to come. People's behavior is slow to change. And as we are all human beings, we have a resistance, huge resistance towards any change. And whatever has been established has rooted because there has been years of conviction that has taken place for this behavior to happen. Now changing this behavior from here to something else will be again, uh, will be taking years for any change. So you know when the things are established, it, it comes out of very scientific research, very scientific finding as to what is good for us and what is not. Right now, climate change has actually hasn't given us any time uh, to, to have the luxury of uh, going slow. Even then, the technology and the people's behavior and the um, parameter, the indicators to record change uh, are still still evolving. They are they need to be established, right? Everybody needs to uh, needs to understand that these are the indicators with which we can claim that we are doing something. My indicator will be very different from yours. I'll tell you one example. I do a garden. I have a garden. I have a balcony garden because that is the place I have. Not many people have balcony as uh, well. So I cite my own thing, uh, whatever I'm doing. So balcony garden is one way of contributing towards climate. Repurposing clothes is another way. Becoming minimalist is the third way. Using public transport when it is most required and not using any transport, going by work is the fourth stage. So these are the ways with which I think I am contributing. And these are the established ways as well. But is it possible for everybody to accept these ways or adopt these ways in their lifetime? No. People have different sets of problems and that is why the indicators will be different for them and we accept that. Now, since there is no common 5, 10, or 15 indicators, we need to be very flexible in asserting, ascertaining as to which are the things that we are contributing. So I have given this example to tell you that since the indicators are different, it is very difficult to evaluate uh, our contributions in an individual way. Some people, uh, they 
put the organization ahead and uh, do things which will help the organization in long term. This may not be the ideology of other people. And that is perfectly fine. Everybody has their own background with which they form the reality and uh, understand their reality, interpret their reality as per their background. This is also a truth. So, I am not very superior to others. Then, how would I or you establish your supremacy? So, that is why I suggest two things. One is to achieve significance and the to do that, we need to be very convinced about the unbeatable USP that we have. Trust me, everybody, every human being so far, I have uh, interacted and worked with almost 20,000 professionals uh, and many thousands target segment who are both literate and illiterate. Even in very, very illiterate people, I have found at least two qualities which can uh, establish their own unique individuality. There can be more than two, definitely. But I have discovered at least two. So if we go by those two to start with, there will be many more unique capabilities that one has. And development sector is such a sector with which we can easily have a personal development course roadmap with which we can do individual growth. We can serve the community immediately, our workplace and link it to a global vision as well. My global vision is to have a calmer, cooler and greener globe. You can have yours, you can formulate that, you, or you can adopt mine also. After all, we all are uh, working for the same thing. If a cooler, calmer and greener globe happens, it happens for everybody. It is not just for me. But I can contribute. You can contribute your own way with whatever conviction that you have. And uh, um, the trick is to have that conviction. The same thing will have different aspects, angles. For me, having a balcony garden, uh, working, working my uh, to my office, using public transport, being a minima minimalist, uh, staying simple, is my way of contributing towards that calmer, cooler, and greener blue. I propose to. Uh, contribute towards the calmer glow by being peaceful at workplace, which also means that I have less controversy, less conflict with my colleagues. How do I do that? By establishing my own uniqueness in the organizational setup and contribute thereby towards the organizational development. It is my way and I strongly believe that everybody can do as much as one can do and uh, but one should do. If we don't have a particular design to contribute or we do not have that 
mentality to contribute, we cannot contribute. Even though we are, uh, we can contribute. This is as simple as that. If we plan to contribute, we can contribute. So, do you plan? And why or why not you can plan? It all depends on the mindset, right? Whether you will have time or you won't have time, it depends on the mindset. And why I talk about time? Because professionals have time management is big issue. The more you grow, the more will be the uh, concern for time management. And there are ways one can manage one's time. You do not have to be doing the same thing in different uh, roles, job roles. So as you progress to, a, to the next job role, your work needs to be delegated to somebody else. How can you delegate somebody without training that person? So you have to have that conviction first that ultimately because you will be growing to another role, you need to establish a second uh, line, second rank leadership will take over from you. Simple, right? But it requires a plan. And for everybody, every professional, it is different. It has to be different. Everybody will work in their way. But everybody has 24 hours in life every day. And that 24 hours, how you work is the thing that we'll be discussing in our course, in our uh, uh, setup, in our alliance. And why uh, we need to do this is the environment is more powerful than our own will, our own determination. Do you agree with that? The environment changes our determination to do or not do something. How do we change our environment without changing or changing the place or changing the job? Of course, we cannot change it overnight. But what we can do is the environment changes. With, the first is with our own change. And if we agree on the basic principles of uh, a calmer, cooler, and greener globe, all of us, in our own ways, then we form an alliance, right? That is what Elite Minds Alliance is, is all about. And by being together in that alliance, we create an environment which will help us grow in our own way. That is why this community, this alliance. Your individuality has to be intact. That is why on Bitable USP, and you know USP is unique to every individual human being. So even if we are in a group, each of us is very different. How do we do? How do we achieve what we do? is what we'll be discussing further in this course. It is not a fixed thing. It changes every time a new person joins. How do I manage uh, all this diversity? You know, as I am speaking, the basic <coughs> premise with which we all operate are very, very common. For example, courage, time management, decision making, empathy, all leadership qualities are same, even though people are different. And how much we practice each based on our personality type is what con constitutes the reality, right? And with which we work. It's simple, but it gets complex when 
uh, we bring in our own perspectives into this. But I don't see anything wrong with different perspectives because the ultimate aim is the same. You can reach to the center from any point in the circle. It doesn't matter as long as our we have the common goal. So I'll be speaking more about our course and material that I bring in the subsequent uh, live that I'll be doing. Uh, my apologies for this recording because uh, I am operating on a spare laptop. As soon as my own laptop comes, uh, I will be doing live. Right now I cannot do. So thank you and uh, we'll speak to you tomorrow. Thank you.